Hey, what's up, guys? It's Moose here, and today uh, I was uh, there was a suggestion in the comments and made to me of uh, through Instagram uh, by Non Rumble. Uh, he suggested that I show up my DC collection, and uh, so I'm gonna show off more to my DC collection because there's only like three shelves here. But uh, so yeah, we'll start off with uh, my DC villains. My well, more specifically. My Arkham Villains collection. So this is all from Batman Arkham Origins, Arkham Asylum, Arkham City, and Arkham Knight. So these are all the figures that I have in my possession. So you know we have Zaz. This Zaz here actually. Um, I got him at a, excuse me. I got him at a Comic Con, and he was about twenty bucks. And this Zaz goes for quite some money, uh, surprisingly. Uh, so yeah, so I just uh, share that little info with you. Same, uh, same thing goes with the Joker. The Joker I got at Comic Con too. Uh, he was in box, and same with Zaz. He was in box as well. Unfortunately, I broke the the knife, the other knife that he came with. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and fix it. So hopefully I can fix it. Um, so we have Man Bat in the back. Here goes Strange. And Raz Al Ghul. Rach, Rich, Ra, is it Raz or Raish Al Ghul? I can't, I can never get it right. I don't know which one it is, if it's Roz or Raish. And anyway, but well you can uh, kind of see Hush in the back. Uh, I Actually, I watched the new Batman Hush movie. I thought it was pretty all right. No, I think it's okay. Um, you have Penguin, uh, Deadshot, okay, Kill the Croc, and all the Harley Quinns, you know, Harley Quinzel. Yeah, so this is all my uh, my Arkham villains, and I'm pretty happy with how this all turned out. And then down here is specifically my Batman shelf. So this is all like Batman figures, like Batman related figures, like Red Hood, Robins, you know, stuff from Gotham, etc. So uh, the helmet, um, I didn't lose the helmet for the Thrasher. I just put it in a bag. Um, I, I need to find it. Um, yeah, I have the the Thrasher Batman from the Court of Owls story. And then, you know, we have uh, Alfred from Gotham, Edward Nigma from Gotham, uh, Oracle, DC Universe Classics Batman, uh, DC Universe Classics Nightwing. Got some Dark Knight trilogy stuff here and there. You got the Batman, got the John Blake, Catwoman, got Bruce Wayne back there. We got uh, Batman, uh, right here from Batman Noir slash Batman Damned. I think it takes place in the same universe, I think. Um, not entirely sure. Uh, then we got this Batman from the Greg Capullo line, R.I.P. Uh, I wish they made more. You know, we got Robin. We got both Batgirls back there from the Greg Capullo line and from the Arkham games. We got Mutant Leader right there. Got the Joker. Got Red Hood. You know, we got Heath Ledger Joker back there. We got Batwing, Batwoman. Got a uh, Mutant Leader that turned to a bat. I forgot the names that they became after they joined Batman's group in The Dark Knight Returns. I forgot. Um, Harvey Bullock back there. We got the Joker from Dark Knight Returns. We got Batman from the Dark Knight Returns. We got Alfred. Hopefully, I get the new Alfred coming out. Uh, we got DC Universe Classics Batgirl. We got uh, DC Icons Harley Quinn. And I was, oh yeah, there it is. There's DC Icons uh, Batman right there. Yeah. So and we got Two Face. Which Two Face is my favorite out of the Dark Knight trilogy figures that I have. Yeah, so he's my favorite. Just the amount of detail they put onto him was so good. Let's get let's actually get a closer look on that because look at that. It looks fantastic. Looks just like Aaron Eckhart. Yeah, so anyway. Yeah, this is my Batman shelf here, all Batman stuff. Then down here is just DC Universe slash like Arrowverse kind of stuff. So it's a little bit darker down here, so I hope you guys can see. But we got like DC collectibles back here, like in Justice League, and then we have like some DC um, 
DC uh, Arrowverse stuff, you know, uh, Firestorm, Hawk Girl. She doesn't have her wings on right now, but um, yeah, DC Universe Classics Beast Boy, which that was a gift. Uh, the the Nightwing and the Beast Boy was a gift from Billy Mahoney. So shout out to Billy Mahoney. Um, and then uh, we have the DC Icon Superman. You have the, some of the Watchmen figures. Uh, yeah, you can see uh, Doctor Manhattan and Silk Spectre back there, and they had Comedian and uh, Night Owl, and then Ozzy Mendez is somewhere in the back there. Uh, he's yeah, there he is. He's right behind Martian Manhunter. You got the DC Universe Classics, Black Adam, got Martian Manhunter from Supergirl. And then we got Green Arrow from both versions. We got uh, Superman or Jor-El. I think it's supposed to be Jor-El from um, DC Universe Classics, I think. Or just some version of Superman. I don't remember. Um, then we have uh, uh, Zod-El, I think. I think his name is Zod-El or Zor-El. I, I don't remember. Uh, let me know in the comments if you know his name because I forgot. Um, but yeah. I think he's a cool Superman. I really, I wish they went with his white and blue, white, red, and blue costume, because I prefer that one over this one. But that's just me. Then we have, you know, Kit Flash, Parademon, Darkseid, Lex Luthor in the back, the armored Lex Luthor. We got some Crime Syndicate with the DC Essentials uh, uh, Reverse Flash. And we have the, you can see the DC Icons, uh, Wonder Woman back there. And then we have the, the new Shazam figure. Right next to the old Shazam. I thought that'd be pretty fun. Uh, originally he was doing a dab and then my friend made fun of me. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, anyway. Um, yeah, so this is all my DC Universe shelf. Now I guess we're gonna go over here, I guess we'll... Take a look what's in this other part of my room. We got some posters, all that stuff. Got some DC, uh, not DC, I mean Marvel, uh, Marvel female uh, plates, Marvel girls plates. Got Captain Marvel, Sparta Gwen, uh, Sparta Woman, and Silk. I got those for $5 at uh, GameStop. That was pretty cool. You know, I got my Funko Pops right here. All my Funkos. Um, I don't care what I hate everything he says. I like these. Although he does have a point. Um, I count some of them. So anyway, uh, we go up here. Then we have my Marvel 12-inch uh, line. Marvel. Uh, I don't remember what they're called, but they're the 12-inch figures that they discontinued. Uh, but I have pretty much all of them. The only one that the only one I don't have is Daredevil. So if someone can hook me up, that'd be great. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, but yeah, uh, this is all the 12-inch figures here. You know, we got Deadpool with his burrito or chimichanga back there with Headpool. And the Black Suit Spider-Man. The Black Suit Spider-Man is my favorite. I think I think the Black Suit Spider-Man and along with the, the Thor. Those two are my favorite so far. Um, then down here... It's my Star Wars shelf. So we have Star Wars figures from this, this, cannot speak, specifically the Star Wars heroes. So from the prequels and from the new trilogy and from the old trilogy. So, uh, you know, we have Leia, we have both versions of Leia from uh, Empire Strikes Back and from New Hope. Then we have uh, Han Solo. We got Luke Skywalker, Ray, Finn, DJ. I don't even know why I have DJ. But I guess since I really like the actor, I thought why not. Then we have both versions of Ray. I really like this this Ray. I really like this Ray a lot. This she's my favorite. For a while it was that one, but I really like this one. And then um Mason Windu. Got Anakin back there with Obi-Wan and Ahsoka. Uh, we have the new Han from uh, the Best Bin Han, I think. Then we have Ezra. And then we have a uh, Last Jedi Luke, not Last Jedi. My bad. 
I meant Return of the Jedi. Return of the Jedi, Luke. That's my fault. Uh, imagine if I made that mistake and didn't notice it. Oh, yeah, and this is my favorite Luke back here. Uh, Pilot Luke. The new Pilot Luke that came out. Yeah. Uh, I hope... I'm wondering if I should get the new Yoda. I haven't seen the new Yoda anywhere. So, let me know if I should get the new Yoda. The new Yoda's worth it. Because I heard the head sculpt alone makes it worth it. Uh, so then we go down here, and then we have my Star Wars The Villains shelf. So we have Darth Maul front and center, because he's one of my favorites. Um, then we have Unmasked Darth Vader here. Then we have Masked Darth Vader. Then we have the Emperor, General Grievous, um, Darth Raven, or Raven, I think it's Raven. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. All right, Tarkin... Stormtroopers, Captain Phasma, Snoke in his chair. We got Kylo Ren. We got two Kylo Rens. Um, we got Hux, Boba Fett. You know, just just got some characters back here. Um, I wish I knew the. I'm I'm blanking on some names right now, but um, but yeah, you get the point. This is essentially all like the the Sith Lords and evil characters from the Star Wars lore. Then down here it's pretty small, but this is my NECA shelf. Uh, so we have all figures from NECA that so a lot of these don't have their accessories because I put them in the bag because uh, I was cleaning and everything. So, uh, but yeah, we have the Pennywise back here, right here. This is my newest one. Then we have uh, the Xenomorph back there from Alien uh, Covenant. And then we have uh, Kick-Ass and Hit-Girl. We have Ash with the two uh, the demon children. I forgot the actual names. Uh, uh, Deadite. Deadite kids. The Deadites. Yeah. And then we have Kratos. I wonder if I want to get the two pack with uh, Kratos and his kid. Uh, boy. And his name's not Boy, but you get the point. Um, then you can kind of see you can see Hellboy, and uh, I'm trying to remember his name, but he was played by Doug Jones. Um, but I can't remember his name right now. It's blanking. But uh, yeah, if you know his name, let me know because it'll probably come after me after the video is over. Uh, then we have just three right now, currently three NECA uh, Sin City figures. So. Yep, uh, just we got Yellow Bastard, we got Marv, and we have Wendy. So, this is what I have so far, and he's holding the head of uh, Kevin. So, yeah, I, I really like the movie, I really like the first one, and the book is great. The books, uh, the books are great. Not just specifically the book the movie's based on. Well, it's based on a couple, um, but anyway... Uh, I really just like the movie, and I really like the figures. They based on, even though they, they have really no articulation, they were like statues. I still really enjoy them a lot. So yeah, this is pretty much it right here, and I guess I'll show you guys uh, the last things in my collection that I'm, I'm proud of the most. Boom, Hot Toys. So uh, we have I only have three Hot Toys at the moment. Uh, my Hot Toys Wolverine right here from the Wolverine. You see right there, it says Wolverine, the Wolverine. Um, sorry, my shadow's blocking the way. I have to get out there. So yeah, he looks fantastic. Um, then we have Peter Quill, a.k.a. Star-Lord. And uh, his eyes light up, but I guess I'll show that in a second. I'll show that right now. Boom. You can kind of see it <laughs> but i hope you can kind of see it if not then that was that wasn't worth it uh <laughs> but uh yeah his lies his eyes light up and he comes with a star lord head that looks just like uh chris pratt looks great he even has like a little like uh piece on the side of his ear if it'll focus it's not focusing but he has a side piece on his ear that we can activate his mask so that's pretty cool. Then we have the Iron Spider from uh, Avengers Infinity War. Now this one's the last one that I, I purchased. Uh, so, yeah, this guy is great. 
And the cool thing, he comes with a Peter Parker head. And I'll put that on. There you go. So it's magnetic. So it looks just like Tom Holland. It looks fantastic. I uh, really love this figure. Really love this guy a lot. And uh, I think I have him in a good pose. I watched a video, How to Be a Good Poser, by uh, SciShow Collectibles. And it's a really good, fun series. So yeah, I watched uh, that video on this figure. So hopefully that, uh, that, that video helped. So I hope I have a really good pose here. So yeah, anyways, guys, this is basically the end, end of the video. So what, let me go. Let me know what you guys liked. Uh, did you guys like my DC you, DC stuff? My hot toys, uh, my Star Wars stuff, my NECA stuff. What, what? Let me know what you guys liked. Anyway, uh, I guess I'll catch you guys later, and I'll see you guys soon. All right, peace.